The final table is set at the 2012 World Poker Tour Championship $25,000 main event. 152 players entered this prestigious event, and now only six remain to battle for the $1.19 million first place prize and the title of WPT Champion. The final table will get underway on Saturday afternoon, and here are the final competitors. Your chip leader by a wide margin is German pro Marvin Rettenmeyer with 6.715 million, roughly 44% of the remaining chips in play. Rettenmeyer also has a wealth of experience despite his youth with 50 caches, 6 career titles and more than 1.7 million in prior tournament earnings. Rettenmeyer, who is currently ranked 67th in the player of the year race, could move as high as 12th place if he goes on to take down this event. We spoke with Rettenmeyer after he reached the final table. Um, yeah, it started with, uh, I won like the first two or three hands of the day and then I got into a huge flip with Hafiz Khan, which gladly I could win and uh, yeah, that was huge. That was for like 60 big blind pot. Yeah, I don't know, it's just everything, like every hand went, went really well for me actually. Um, I won a couple of good ones post-flop and, uh, and then in the end I, I busted uh, Kamun in uh, another flip so I'm running really well and yeah it's gonna be hard to stop me if I run like that and uh, with that chip lead I think I have like very very good chances to take it down. We also asked Retton Meyer for his thoughts on his opponents. I think it's a very tough table for sure. Um, well I'm happy I have the grind on my right with uh, the second biggest chip stack and then Steve O'Dwyer is uh, just very very tough. Uh, on my left, even when he has a short stack, he still like he doesn't give chips away. He makes it tough for you every single time. Um, and then uh, yeah, Nick Schumann is a very good player. He's a little short though as well now. And uh, uh, my friend from France, uh, Philippe, uh, is uh, yeah, he's he's short as well. So I don't know. I, I really like my chances right now. That's all I can say. Entering Saturday's final in second position is Michael the Grinder Mizraki with 2.56 million in chips. The 31-year-old pro is one of poker's biggest stars with more than 11.9 million in earnings and 20 titles to his name including two World Series of Poker gold bracelets and two prior WPT titles. The Grinder will certainly be a force to be reckoned with at the final table. Coming in in third place is Steve O'Dwyer with just over 2 million in chips. O'Dwyer is currently ranked 44th in the Player of the Year race as a result of making four final tables before this event in 2012, and could move as high as 7th place in the rankings with a win. But he is no newcomer to the scene. O'Dwyer has 87 career caches and 7 titles to his name, with combined live and online tournament earnings of nearly 2.9 million. Fourth in chips is Nick Schulman with just over 1.5 million. Schulman has a World Series of Poker bracelet, induced to 7 no limit, and a massive WPT title to his name, and has accumulated more than 4.8 million in earnings over the years, and is sure to be a threat come Saturday. Fifth in chips is Trevor Pope with 1.48 million. Pope is primarily an online cash game player, but has had prior success at the Bellagio, winning a $1,000 prelim at the 2010 Festa Al Lago, and then going on to finish 24th in that series' $10,000 main event. Rounding out the final table is the enthusiastic Frenchman Philippe Torza with 895,000. Hailing from Paris, Torza is a businessman who takes his poker seriously, accumulating 8 career caches, with his largest score coming from a 25th place finish in the 2011 World Series Europe main event for $44,000. So there you have the final 6 players in the 2012 World Poker Tour Championship $25,000 main event. Make sure to stay tuned to Card Player on Saturday as they play on to determine which of these incredible players will become the next World Poker Tour Champion.